You know, sometimes after a big storm, all sorts of things happen. Tree branches come down, erosion uncovers things you should have cleaned up a long time ago. Like, look at this over here. This giant tank just left right in the middle of the creek. It's disgusting. Now, the good thing, as an environmental steward, is you can actually clean up something like this yourself. I know it looks dangerous, but I can assure you, this is not gonna hurt you. I'll even prove it. Here, watch this, see? See? No consequence whatsoever. You could do that for hours. Okay, uh, nice to be back. Uh, today we're going to try something a little less explodey. We're gonna deal with some winter windfalls. Now you might be thinking, do I just burn this stuff? Well, no, because there are things you can do with this wood that are good for both the atmosphere and the soil. Now, I've bucked these fallen trees up with a chainsaw to make it easier for us to carry. Large pieces, they're hard to carry, and if you drop them, they're gonna hurt your foot. But these little guys, I mean, if you drop them, it's not like they're gonna explode. <laughs> Hi, I'm uh, feeling better now. So today we're gonna try something a little more uh, low risk, straightening this fence post. Uh, ready, here we go. <gasps> okay, whew. So now Next time on Nature Tips, we'll show you how to start a bonfire with the power of song and uh, gasoline. Never roasted a single marshmallow with the power of song. Don't burn your power of song with gasoline.